Guys, girls, we're gonna make buttercream, and to make buttercream, you need to use the dimensions like this. So, for example, you'd need 50 grams of butter and 150 grams of icing sugar. That would that's the correct that's the correct amounts to use to make the perfect buttercream. You can add anything you want to this to make it the perfect buttercream. You need maybe some vanilla essence or some lemon zest if you were making a lemon cake like we did earlier. Or maybe, maybe, just maybe, you could use any flavor you wanted such as orange or chocolate or, well, you could even use anything Maybe even an OXO cube if you wanted some beefy icing or some, that, that's about it, yeah, or you can use anything you want. So what we're going to do, get the butter like this and a spoon and we're going to get around 50 grams of this bad boy, we're going to whack that into our weigh the scales and then for the icing sugar we need to add double and a bit of this so double plus a hundred that's the same amount that's double And then two times that amount. <coughs> I, I absolutely hate icing sugar. Just so you know. Um, sorry, we've just gone from whatever that was to um, broad Yorkshire. Yeah, so I really hate icing sugar. You cannot, it just goes everywhere. Absolutely everywhere. I'm actually, I can actually taste it now in my nose. It's all over this top. Looks like Al Pacino's been having a look, just had a little sesh here. Because you all know what movie I'm referring to. Yeah, so we just then you just have to like try and bash all this sugar into your into your mar into your, like butter or margarine. So and whilst you're doing it, icing sugar goes everywhere. So I suggest using a massive mixing bowl, like three foot by three foot, and just doing it in the very bottom with long arms. This is just a joke. Seriously, you can't taste it. Whilst you're mixing it, it might, I don't know, it might, it might turn into hard work, but with those, with those amounts you can't go wrong. You might have seen some of my earlier videos in the old kitchen before we got upgraded. Um, I did try icing sugar. It, did, it didn't work. Uh, icing, but, buttercream in fact, icing sugar. Icing sugar is an ingredient. Yeah, so this one's, uh, this is actually for Dan Davison, because I'm pretty sure this guy would love to eat this on his own. Just have a little bit by the side of his drum kit, and just like start hammering the buttercream out. It is good. Um, and obviously you can shove this in your butterfly buns. If you're going to add a little bit of lemon to this, or a lemon flavouring, you could even add it to your lemon drizzle cake, um, which we might do in a later. We might do. This would be like a different video combined with a different video. Is that even possible? Watch to find out. Mm. So if you're watching this video and you haven't liked, shared or subscribed, uh, you should feel 
bit ashamed of yourself, really. Just why watch me if you're not going to do that? Look, look at my buttercream. Look at that. Can you see that? It's a lighting look, look. Look at that consistency. It's almost perfect. You need to really beat it and whip it. That's what I'm doing whilst I'm talking to you, by the way. If you can't see my, I'm not doing anything else with my hand. Okay, I'm not. I'm actually making buttercream for adults only. Okay?